What's going on traders? This is Mike with Tactical Traders doing some end of the day scans. And right now I am looking at ticker symbol KEY and today is August 27th. And I have the daily chart pulled up over the past year for KeyBank. And we can see right now that there's been some areas of resistance and definitely a, uh, a pattern forming. And before I go into that, I just wanna say please, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel. We do post these videos daily. And it's always great to see another like and another subscriber it gives us the motivation to keep coming out with these videos for you. All right, and now back into Key Bank. So to highlight some areas of interest, I can see that right here, roughly about 1350, has been an area of resistance right here. The price did momentarily pop above this. However, it did get sucked back down and has been active resistance here, 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 and past here as well. So I'm just gonna zoom up a little bit more, and now. We do see that the price did go down to a low of 745 and then continuing slowly on its new trend back up causing a triangle pattern right here. So we have a nice trend. Price did bounce off this trend line multiple times and now the range is getting tight. So we're going to be definitely on watch for this. You could play this a couple different ways as a possible swing trade. Uh, maybe buying around here around the $12 range for a trend bounce up to the 1350 area and playing within the channel itself, the triangle itself, or possibly looking for a breakout beyond that. Now pulling it up into a more intraday chart, we're looking at the 10 day, 30 minute. And the price has been definitely moving around. This has been some great range, definitely good for any day trader. Now, if you are looking to possibly just be a quick day trade on this, we can be definitely looking at some of today's action. It opened up and price went straight up, causing a nice bullish pull right here. And then price started to not really pull back, but go in a consolidating fashion to the side, creating a bullpen uh, uh, chart pattern, excuse me, right here. So what we're gonna be looking at is we're gonna be looking at this uh, about 1270, 1275 if you wanna be safe. Um, we're gonna look for a breakout past that point. The range is getting tighter and tighter, so we're gonna be looking for a breakout past that with a considerable amount of increased volume behind it at the same time. At that point, you could definitely be looking for 13 to be tested, I mean 1350 to be tested very uh, quickly. And that is going to be the top of the triangle pattern. So you could absolutely look for the breakout there and make a quick trade of 13 between 1350 and scalp it like that. Or you could be looking to maybe possibly swing trade this for a short amount of time and look for the possible breakout outside of this pattern. How if the price does fall below this bottom yellow trend line, we, we might want to use a little bit more extreme caution. And if you are in the trade at that point, maybe even look to cut losses and move on to a new opportunity. Well, traders, I hope you like this video. Please hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and follow us on StockTwits, Facebook, and Instagram. And we are offering now a free 30-day trial to our private chat room where you get to see all of our trade plans, our entries, our exits, our size, our profit, our loss, and we share our screens with you. Thank you for watching, traders, and until next time, stay profitable.